<laughs> Hello, everyone. How's it going? Let me see if I can find an icon. I don't have one. Yeah, I do. There we go. There we go. Magic Ears. This company is amazing. It is so great. It really is. I, I just love all the training they give. They have really great communication through another portal called Dean Talk. And I just, yeah, it's a cool company. Very, very cool company. I will say this. I will say this. I could not cancel fast enough. I couldn't cancel fast enough. I just couldn't. What does that mean? It means that I am not personally, I am not made for these classes. I'm just not made for them. One to four kids, which isn't really a big deal. So please, if you're, if you're looking to apply, do it, try it. I, I'm still like telling myself, just try it. And then um, I was just doing Monday, Wednesday, Friday, just one class, or I'm sorry, Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, just one class. And, I'm, and I did one student, I've done two, I've done three, and then I've done four. I just finished a class. Maybe this is too soon to say, but they have an amazing cancellation policy where you have these carrots and you've got like, you get a free cancellation with no penalty I've, with another company where you have to pay, you know, you have your base pay, then you have to pay if you cancel, it's even more than your base pay. It doesn't make any sense. It's such a penalty. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Magic Ears for having this wonderful policy for you and for me. They don't want a teacher coming in who's not good, whose timing is off. I just actually have my timing card here. You know, when here's the slides and here's the minutes, I was, I'm not good. And they're coaching me and they're helping me. And I am so thankful for it. But I think for the both of us, <clears throat> I'm going to do a favor and just cancel. I have a scheduling conflict anyway, sort of, kind of. So it, it just was going to stress me out. And that's not, that's not what magic years wants. They want happy, exciting, and wonderful teachers, not someone who's a little timid and stressed and, and nervous. So, and anxious and all those not good things. So <clears throat> my puppet, Timmy and I, we are just going to take a little break real quick from uh, some of the classes, because I will tell you this, while I was teaching my class this morning, I got booked for another class for another company, less than 24 hours. So that means I got two extra bucks coming my way for that class. And just, so it's much better on another platform for me personally, the one-on-one -on -one interactive slides and platform, <clears throat> man, excuse me. If you have any questions, let me know, comment. You other magic ear teachers who are wonderful and successful. God bless you. You're, I just, I'm just trying to jack up my students and trying to do all the things. I still need lots of practice. <laughs> I wish we had more one-on-one -on -one practice with the interface and with a person. Um, otherwise I think I'm good. I just um, would think more walkthroughs would be great. The workshops are wonderful, but maybe having a one-on-one -on -one individual uh, workshop would be much even better. But again, I have Ding Talk and I could talk to my coaches and I have great resources. Magic Ears really, really invests in their teachers. I personally am used to older students, not so um, animated kids show, you know, I'm just not that. And I, and I do my best. I, I mean, I don't care what job it is. You've got to do your best and you have got to try and you can't just quit. Um, so I don't think I've quit. I just couldn't cancel fast enough in the next class. So I'm not coming to the class anxious, nervous, and just not prepared. You're an independent contractor. You need to represent the company that you have contracted with as best as you can. That's the agreement. You know their policies, you know their culture, you know how their synergy is, and they want you to do their methods the best you can. And I still have some training to do before I continue. I definitely know that. So know your weaknesses, know your strengths. I know my strengths. I definitely know I'm great at pronunciation correction. I'm great at, you know, teaching grammar and other fun tech techniques. I'm fun. <laughs> I just, uh, I think Magic Gears has the three bottom lines. And I can nail one or two, but uh, the third one, I just really have got to work on it. Mostly progress, class progress. Wow. And it's good. It's good to know. It's good. Be challenged. Go out of your comfort zone. Do some things. Okay. That's it. I just wanted to pop in here and give my, you know, honest, transparent, no filter 
uh, feedback that again, Magic Ears is a great company. It's not a fit for me right now. I, my teaching types, it's just different. <laughs> but I know many of my friends are, are nailing it. So again, bless you. <laughs> All right. I'll let you know. Do I go back? Do I get training? I'll, I'll let you know in the next video. Sorry, I'm shaking my computer, my desk. Bye-bye.